New Mexico calls itself the land of enchantment. But in politics, it's been the land of the photo finish. Al Gore won here eight years ago by 366 votes. George W. Bush won here in 2004 by about 6,000 votes. But when John McCain came here last weekend, he found himself behind by as much as 13 points. We're a few points down. Why? One key is demographics. New Mexico has the largest percentage of Hispanic voters of any state in the union, more than 37 percent. And Obama is leading among that group by better than three to one. Most often, Hispanics in New Mexico are very much concerned about jobs and the economy and those domestic issues. But this time, it is just outranking everything else. Another key, geography. The Obama campaign in New Mexico has reached beyond the traditional Democratic strongholds of Albuquerque and Santa Fe to focus on rural communities, heavily Hispanic communities like Española here to the north. In fact, Obama was here in September with a blunt political message. To the Hispanic community, I want you to start actually voting your numbers. Strategically and geographically, Española is the best way to reach out to all the, the remote areas within northern New Mexico. And the Obama ground game, says Mayor Joseph Maestas, is unprecedented. His campaign has 39 offices statewide in comparison to less than 10 for John Kerry in 2004. Uh, Barack Obama's total is uh, as much as four times that of uh, the McCain campaign. That outreach has swelled Obama's core of volunteers in this small town of 10,000. We're just honored that uh, he even stopped in our community, and so we feel like we want to repay that, that courtesy by uh, volunteering and get directly involved. But McCain's campaign is banking on the socially conservative leadings of many Hispanics here. Well, the majority of Hispanics in New Mexico are Catholic. They're pro-family, pro-life, and I believe that he does represent our values. Those values, plus McCain's Western war hero background, would likely have made him highly competitive in most years against most opponents. But this is a very different year. Jeff Greenfield, CBS News, Española, New Mexico.